Okay, uh, this is problem 14 from chapter 4 of CFEN 7. So, uh, the, uh, similar to the previous problem, except for we have monthly payments, which anytime you have monthly payments, that means you have monthly compounding. So, uh, uh, so Sunyu plans to deposit $175 into an account at the end of each month for the next seven years so she can take a bucket list trip. The investment will earn 5.4% compounded monthly. So how much will she save in the account after the last $175 deposit is made in seven years? So future value with the formula. So it's $175 times one plus 0.054. Uh, we make it a monthly rate, divide by 12, and then seven years monthly, so seven times 12, or 84, minus one. And then we've also got them down here, we've got to make this a monthly rate, so 0 0.054 divided by 12. So. <clears throat> So that is $17,816.01. So on a calculator, and 7 times 12, that's 84 months. So since it's monthly, we've got to make it a monthly rate. So 5.4 divided by 12 is 0.45. There's nothing in the account to begin with. PV is zero. Payment is the $175. Entered as a negative. Compute future value. And $17,816.01. So um, if we were to make the payments at the beginning of the month, that uh, we uh, to all we have to do would be um, we would divide this by by um, or, sorry multiply this by one plus 0.054 divided by twelve so our point uh, uh, one plus 0.45 or point uh, zero zero four five sorry so it uh, because it uh, it's uh, when we're using the formula so but to do uh, the that so oops and or just uh, again just multiply add to this formula one plus point oh four five divided by twelve so um there we go one seventeen eight one six point oh one Multiply by 1 plus 0.054 divided by 12. So we're just adding one month of interest. That's $17,896.18. So on, a calcul on using the, the calculator functions, second, hit uh, PGNs. Second, enter. Oh, and um, one of the things you always want to do is when you're done with the calculation, mo most uh, uh, make sure you uh, get out of begin mode. So you do the same thing. It's second begin, second enter would get it out of the that. So then compute future value, and that's uh, oops. Seventeen thousand eight hundred ninety-six dollars and eighteen cents. So, same answer.